All right, uh, we are here. I'm just trying to show you uh, the way we go to our uh, WizardQ class. I'm here on WizardQ. I scheduled the class, and the name of the class is History. It's Life's Teacher. I'm clicking on Launch the class. So we are going to go to the class uh, in a second. You will be watching how the class is opening. And here we go. This is what you see. And we are just uh, setting the class. You can see I'm here. Hello, Helena. I need to test the speakers. <coughs> You can see my webcam so and my microphone, but my microphone will not uh, be active before the class starts. So I'm good to go. Here we go. Okay, this is me. This is Halina. And we can see the virtual class. Uh, we can see here, let me use the selection tool and I will be using the pointer. So here we got whiteboard and these are selection, uh, this is a selection tool and we can use the pointer, the pen, we can use, write the text here if we wish, like for example, hi, this is Halina, and uh, we can do all kinds of things here, we can put smiley if we wish, okay, where is my smiley? Right here. And we can also change uh, the color. Uh, I lost the pointer. Okay, so there is my smiley. And here we can fill in the color. The color of, of everything we want. Okay. Here we go. This is the whiteboard and tab option. We can change the background color. Okay. We can change it and we can use, for example, this one. And I like blue, so, but um, let's go back to the white. And uh, what can we have here? See, I clicked on File, so we, we, we can have New Tab, New Tab, see, the we've got the second whiteboard, if we wish. Then we can close the tab, right? Yes, we can take a snapshot uh, from my computer for example okay okay so you can see that uh, I can do very many different things upload from a desktop let's upload my presentation right here it's going to be I hope it's going to be very fast and uh, as you can see they want us to upload our videos or fail oh this is failed why is it failed because no it shouldn't be like that it should come uh, no because i have it in my library probably so let's get rid of this Yes, are you sure to want? Yes. I was just trying to show you how to... Now we, we can undo things, redo, copy, paste, delete, all kinds of things. We can also... This is the feature... Okay, I lost the 
uh, pointer here yeah I'm showing you all kinds of things and here content library you can see the my content library and and these are things that uh, I uploaded before the class I was preparing for the class if I want to have uh, this in my class right now uh, I can edit to the class let's see add to the class All right okay already edit okay no then as you can see I edit all those presentations to this class then I can try to search for different kinds of things as you can see I have plenty it's a lot I have here so I'm closing the tab <clears throat> and here is the, the material for one of my classes but uh, if I want to this is for my business uh, English for one of my students okay but we don't want to analyze the text uh, just uh, no uh, no no I don't want to but I would like to add the whiteboard here and I would like to show you uh, different features and uh, here uh, I can upload uh, you saw it and uh, this click on this and we will have media player I did not uh, I have only I will show you what I got and let's play it right now okay I hope it's gonna play it's buffering okay and you can listen to Chopin and <clears throat> what we can do we can uh, if it is video we can have it move it all the way in here and uh, if you don't want to have it on your screen you put it down and then we have screen sharing screen sharing it's very handy very helpful tool and uh, it shouldn't take a long time but uh, yeah minimize and okay stop sharing your screen because it takes time and at least you can see that my uh, my uh, video is is is, uh, is long so i don't want you to get bored with me then there is a pulling you can you can do the pulling oh see do you like with a cube and there is a arrow here we have to uh, make it all right and uh, options right and uh, save right and publish during the class and you will have the results if people are here they will be voting and uh, I can share the results end of the poll all right and I'm going farther breakout rooms if you have many many students you can use the <laughs> the breakout room uh, so you put like few people here few people there and then uh, you can see this is the audio video uh, and we can see the quality is excellent it's very perfect and then uh, I have the writing control which means that I can write in here and of course we can write using the chat box the chat box is hi every uh, every one and you can use 
emoticons. Oh my! Favorite is this one because I'm trying to encourage people all the time, and this is just like that. You can make the font uh, bigger. So because I don't see very well, I always ask my students to use uh, 14 or even uh, 16. You can change the color of your writing. Uh, you can have it uh, white, you can have it red, you can have it blue. And let's see. Hello. Hi again. Right? But you can see it better. And this time I will use my second favorite. <laughs> And you can see in, in the background, you can see my my driveway because I'm sitting in my study room and this is located in my basement. All right, and what else we got? We have the settings, the mic settings. We can uh, check the volume and be very careful when you do it. We can, the camera is on, I can uh, I can stop the camera if I wish, right? But uh, video status, okay? And now there's no Halina here, right? Because sometimes because of the connection it's better to uh, close the video. And here the speaker settings, as you know we can check the and test right and thank you very much and here we have um, a class options look we can do all kinds of things add whiteboard upload uh, content from desktop uh, add content library share your screen uh, use media player create pool create breakout a room Share class links, which is very important. If you click on it, you can see there is a again, okay, there is a link for attendees and for co presenter. So you just copy the link, click on it, and you can share it, you can send it. And uh, settings. Uh, you could restore the layout and extend the class duration uh, or end and leave the class. So these are those wonderful features. Here we've got the chat box because there's nobody here. Uh, so I have to just uh, show you again how we do this, uh, the things. This is the chat uh, attend this list so you can uh, share this class link, show options and uh, you can see all the attendees. Here is the minimize so you won't have this um, you will have this down on your left hand side and if you let me just do it and uh, close the audio and I'm back with a D list and the chat it's extremely important option because you can copy the chat see chat option copy or if you are not pleased with your attendees and the uh, way they they chat, they use the chat, you can disable chat for everybody. Or you can also, if there's a problem with some of the attendees, you can just uh, enable, I, I'm sorry, disable uh, chatting the chat for this person. You can block the person if you feel that the person is not behaving. And uh, what else?